The NBA slam dunk competition has turned into an absolute joke. In the late 80s, 90s, 2000s, you used to get five to six contestants, some of who were the best dunkers in the NBA. Look at 2000, you got Vince Carter, Steve Francis, McGrady, Stackhouse, Larry Hughes, and Ricky Davis. I blame the judges screwing Aaron Gordon in the 2020 slam dunk competition, because look at what happened after that. Nobody wants to participate anymore. 2021, you had Anfrey Simons, Obi Toppin, and Cassius Stanley com competing. Last year, you had Mac McClung, Trey Murphy, Jericho Sims, and Kenyon Martin Jr. This year, you got two uh, G League players, Mac McClung. You got Obi Toppin's little brother. You couldn't get the real Obi Toppin. You got a rookie in Jaime. And you got a, you do got a star in Jalen Brown, but what happened to all the superstars competing? Why no Ja Morant? We know LeBron James is not going to do it. If he hasn't done it this far, he's not going to wait till age 38, age 39 to go compete in the... You've had people like Michael Jordan, Kobe Bryant. You even had Dr. J, Julius Irvin, compete in the slam dunk competition. This is a pretty recent issue because in 2008, you still did have superstars like Donovan Mitchell competing in it. The best dunkers used to take pride like Andre Iguodala used to compete in the competition. Dwight Howard. Slam dunk competition used to be must watch TV, prime time TV. The slam dunk competition has turned into an absolute bore. And it's unfair to the dunkers because Mac McClung's a great dunker. It's just, he's a G League player. NBA made a huge mistake doing Aaron Gordon dirty that many years. If he won one of these competitions, he'd probably still enter it. So that cuts him off. I wouldn't mind to see uh, Miles Bridges, but they probably don't want him competing because of all of the drama surrounding him and his baby mama. But Ja Morant, no Anthony Edwards, no Zion Williamson, no Giannis, no Zach. Well, Zach's injured, so that's fine. LeBron never competes. No Mitchell, no Westbrook, no Paul George, no Tatum, no Derrick Jones Jr., no, not even Obi Toppin, no DeMar, no AD, no Wiggins. You could even put Jonathan Kaminga in there.